They're not taking the guns away. We're just trying to control things a little bit better. This Ridley O sponsored by Keenvention Yard Info. It's a keen convention, you'll have to go. Okay. Speaking really, if somebody gets right. injured as a result of your restrictions on firearms in the state house, will you be liable for their medical bills? Yeah, right. It's getting crazy. Uh, I beg your pardon. <laughs> Someone said he just followed her with that camera, <laughs> which is what I did, sort of. Hello. Mr. Fields? Yeah. Is that right? Are you Dennis Fields? Yeah. Uh, you're, if, correct me if I'm wrong, but you're a Republican who voted in favor of the ban on guns in the State House. Part of it, is that correct? Yeah. I don't what want was your what was your reasoning on that? My exactly. reason is because when we got fourth grade kids coming in and they're up in that balcony and some nut does something, we don't need everybody with guns. Do you think? I just think that people who want to hunt, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't think we need all this stuff that some of these gun people want. I'm not against gun owners. That's not the point. Every time there's a bill about guns, okay. Oh, you're taking my guns away. That's not true. They're not taking the guns away. We're just trying to control things a little bit better. We have plenty of security in this house. I've been here 14 terms, and I've seen not not even an issue with it. Well, if somebody it's gets feel good legislation for some people. Else. If somebody were to get hurt as a result of your restrictions, would you be willing to help pay their medical expenses? Now, I understand you're a pro-liberty, mostly New Hampshire representative Republican. Why did you vote to ban guns? From I didn't the... vote to ban guns. Oh, okay, you didn't. You're on a list that says you did. I, 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 I won't run this in that case. Uh, you didn't vote in favor of the restrictions on firearms in the state house. Oh, I thought you asked me if I voted to ban guns in the state house in parts of the state house. Oh, absolutely. That was back oh, in January. I thought okay, you said why did okay. I vote to ban guns? No, no, no. I don't vote to ban guns at all. I think you ought to have the right to ban have your gun wherever you want, except in a courthouse. You can't take your gun into the courthouse. And the New Hampshire legislature is, in fact, the general court. So you're We're following a sort of a pattern of history. Thomas Hobbes, in his philosophy, brought us into the state of governing. Thomas Hobbes postulated that in the state of nature, before we formed ourselves into government, life was solitary, nasty, poor, brutish, and short. We form governments to guarantee that there's going to be some security, but I can't beat you over the head and steal your wife and food. And for giving up that freedom, I'm getting the assurance that you're not going to beat me over the head and steal my wife and food. That's the purpose of government. Government should not be absolute. You have a right to have guns, but there are legitimate restrictions on every right. I cannot yell fire in a crowded theater. I cannot bring a gun into the courthouse when a case is being heard. That's why I voted for the simple restriction of not having guns in the general court. But I have this, nothing to do with restricting guns. Yeah. But does places. this make you responsible, though, for anything that bad that happens as a result of people not being able to defend themselves in there? That is a specious argument, because let's say somebody wants to hurt the New Hampshire General Court. What's the best way to do that? It would be to rush in to the front door with an automatic weapon and start spraying people. Now, the amount of time it takes to do that, somebody with a gun in the back row, if he or she stands up and starts shooting at the attacker, the chances are more likely that somebody else is going to be hurt instead of fewer people being hurt. But you've I don't taken want that to responsibility it. away from the individual and then put it on the general court. The so responsibility, you, responsibility for the responsibility, you now. No, the responsibility for defending the house is the policeman that is always there, either in the balcony or in the back of the room. You know that expression, don't, don't, uh, you know, I carry a gun because a policeman is too heavy. 
I don't want to go to the point where we're a posse like the Wild West, where we ride out and hang somebody from the nearest tree. Mm -hmm. That's why we have legitimate restrictions on our freedoms, so that we don't have everybody running around shooting at random. All right, I appreciate the straight answers. You take care of it, Mr. Valcourt. This Ridley O sponsored by Convention Yard Info. It's a keen convention, you'll have to go. Only 50 bucks held near the peak of leaf peeping season in a place that's fascinating even without its natural beauty. The purpose is to focus discussion on New Hampshire freedom activism. November 1st through the 3rd. Convention Yard Info. It's a keen convention, you'll have to go.